Hello, this is Dan Davis here. Today's video is going to be how to install iMetro for DreamBoard. Um, if you do not know how to install DreamBoard, I will have a video. You know what? I just had to install DreamBoard here too. But the two things we need is iFile and DreamBoard. Um, DreamBoard is real simple, so it's going to be real super fast to install DreamBoard, just like iFile. They're both very fast to install from Cydia. Um, iMetro is not in Cydia, so we have to download it from Dropbox. I mean, not Dropbox. Yeah, it downloaded from Dropbox website, and we have to extract it from iFiles. So, um, let's begin. The first thing we're going to do is install iFile, then we're going to install DreamBoard, then we're going to install iMetro from Dropbox website. And we'll have the link from the website in my description, and it will be right down there in the description. And we'll have the link to it. Then you download it from there. You're going to track it from iFiles, and I'm going to show you everything. So just keep you have iFiles and DreamBoard already, pre already installed on your iPad or iOS device. Just head on over to just skip this part and head on to the point where I show you how to install iMetro. So let's begin. First, let's say into Cydia. Let's go to sources. Well, let's first install DreamBoard. Let's go to search. And let's type in DreamBoard. As you can see, DreamBoard is going to pop up, that little blue one, yeah, it's the official one. The rest of them are cracked, you don't have to download a crack because this is free. So let's go to DreamBoard. Where well, you see Modify, it will be Install, you install it. Where well, you see Modify, you just hit Install, it's going to ask you to verify, you verify. Once you get done download, it's going to pop up right here somewhere in the little pop-up box. So I'm going to read to bring you back, go back to Cydia. And once you go back to Cedar, you go back to, you just go down to sources. Okay, Cedar being at home, but by mistake. Okay, we go to sources. Next, we're going to install iFile. iFile is a paid application. Um, if you want not, just want to go to iFile, you just head on over to search. Just pause the video if you're still downloading DreamBoard. Just pause the video right there to the finish. It's only like one second to finish. So right now it should be finished. So let's go to DreamBoard. Not DreamBoard, iPhone, I'm sorry. You see this is iPhone, this is the pay one. The iPhone I believe is four dollars. So you wanna pay, just click that. And you can pay or you download the crack, which will I will show you how to download the crack version. You install the following your the following source. You go to edit, which can be right there where it's done at. Go to add. Add in the following source. I have all my sources written down. Cydia. Oops. C C Y D I A. S A. I will have this source in the description on how to down the source URL in the description. X A E L I Z E dot com. And you click on add source. Gonna add a source. Lie, I'm not gonna show you reinstall it again because sometimes I get problems where it act crazy because I have it. I would have to delete and everything, and I'm not about to delete it because I have a lot of files on there already. So it's going that's how come I didn't reinstall it for you. Okay, sometimes that is really stupid. I'm to try to reinstall it. This one I re-added the source because it's simple. So I'm gonna say done package.
Take me about a second to download. Now, yes, as I'm gonna finish, I'm gonna say return to Cydia. And when they return to Cydia, they go to source right there. You can just click on the source and go straight to our file, or you go to here, look up our file. See, that's the click at our file right here. You have the X on there. You click on it. Where you see modify will be install. So you click on install, install it. It's going to actually verify. It's going to actually return back to Cydia. You turn back to Cydia and you have our file and Dream Boy sitting on your front. On the front of the page. So that's how you download it. Next, we're going to install iMetro. The link will be in the description. The only reason I have the link in my notes is because I don't. Um, I ain't feel like going into my into my website and get it from a website, so I already put the link in uh, my notes. But the link will be in the description. You go to the link; it's gonna come up to the Dropbox. It's gonna say download iMetro Beta 7 or 0.5 or whatever version you're using. Um, so you click the link. It's gonna download. And as you can see, once it downloads, it's going to say open in and open in our file. We're going to hit open in our file. And it comes up right here. I always I have, I have two betas on here because remember, I re download this. I don't know why we download this. But I'm going to hit delete. I'm going to delete this. So I'm going to go to edit. Delete the second one. Oh, there you go. And I'm gonna hit done. I have two ammo here. You're only gonna have one. So we go we click on that. When yours when yours pop up like this, you go to zip viewer. Hit load, go down, hit extract all files, hit done, then you're going to have iMetro 7 downloaded as a folder, extract it, you click the folder, and you're going to pop up like this, once you get inside a folder, you go down until you hit the edit button, I mean, you go up to edit and you select it, go back down, copy, you select iMetro, make sure I show you again. You highlight and you copy iMetro, then you hit done, then you click on the disk, go back to the disk, and you go to Dreamboard, not that one. Dream board, not that one. Okay, I need I need to look at this, not that dream board. And as you can see, I already have it in here, so I'm gonna just delete it. And I'm gonna delete mine so that you won't get confused. Okay, let's re try this again. Edit, iMetro, trash. Move file to trash. 
Okay, now we got it now. I made a stick and hit goes to trash. So we're gonna go down to the clipboard, click on the clipboard, go raise it up, paste. And our metro is in there. We hit done. We go back home. We slide over to see dream board. We click dream board. And that's our metro. You know, our metro, open it. This is how yours should look. Yeah, it's not going to see a lock on right up there. It's going to say any name, whatever name comes with it. This is going to be the developer name. But this is how it by Metro look. It's like a Windows 8 theme. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our YouTube, comment, like, circle us on Google Plus, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and keep up to date with the latest beta versions until the official one comes out to City. And we'll have a video when that happens. And the next video I'm gonna make of our Metro, I'm gonna show you how to update it. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.